such a beautiful fish, man. That's a nice one. <laughs> Stubble is very famous for being the city of cuttlefish, but not only cuttlefish, okay? Because this is where the river Sado joins the Atlantic between Troia and Stubo. There's a beautiful river with plenty of life. I decided to call my friend Tomas and the main goal was to test the new Mezashi casting jigs because he's an expert animating metal lures. And I say, bro, I have some jigs. Let's try them out on your waters. We just put this small boat on the water and went fishing. We target from the four meters to the 10 meters. Our goal was sea bass and probably some weak fish. Since it's new moon, the tides are huge and the stream is very strong. Sometimes it's not very easy to animate a metal lure because it's metal, okay? It's probably one of the hardest lures to animate and to make it attractive enough for the fish to bite. The secret was to fast retrieving from the bottom and not with a lot of tension on the line, waiting for the bite when the jig was dropping. Special thanks to Tomas for receiving me. It's always a great experience to fish with a friend and fishing new waters and getting some knowledge. It was the first time that we used the Mazashi casting jig and we love them. Yeah. Mm, you want to come fish with us? I have a gift for you, man. Some pliers. Hey! hey. <laughs> what kind of fisherman are you to come to fish at 11 a.m., man? This is not time to come fish. <laughs> A crazy one. <laughs> nice, nice. That's a nice fish, man. How fun that rod Very is, Very nice. Man. Very <laughs> sensitive. You think it's a sea bass, no? Hmm. Don't know. Yes, maybe it's a sea bass. Yeah. It is? Oh, that's a nice fish, man. Maybe kilo. I don't know. <laughs> Catching a sea bass on that ultralight detector. Yes! I'm so happy, man. It's gone? Uh, it's okay, bro. <laughs> Which color? Easy is release. It? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, man, but that jig on your hands. That's awesome. That jig in your hands are on fire, man. <laughs> Sometimes. Sometimes. Okay, the other one was way bigger. <laughs> 40. Exactly 40 centimeters. <laughs> That's fish. 40 centimeters sea bass, man. Good job. On the first day, the fish was not very active and we did struggle to get a bite. We had to wait for better conditions to come back to the water and that's what we did. We woke up at 6 a.m. on the sunrise to get advantage of the good weather and that morning was the best session we had. On the first day we noticed that since the fish were really tricky on the bite when the jig was falling we so swapped the treble hooks for the new jaw lock number six and number four so we get a little bit a bigger treble hook a more wide open to set the hook on the sea bass these hooks are extremely sharp and bigger and uh, this might do the difference today <laughs> Come on. Lost it. Oh no, it's a baby. Oh no, it's huh? it's a spotted sea bass. Yeah. It's a spotted sea bass. Man, they are so nervous. Look at this. This is a spotted sea bass. It's not a huge one, but they are so so beautiful. Look at the dots. <laughs> Look at the mark here, the black one. Like, stop, like I told you, you see, the bigger hooks making the difference, how tricky they are hitting just in the, in the corner of the mouth. 
<laughs> today is gonna be the day. Boo! Come on. That's a bigger fish. I think it's a bigger fish. That's a nice sea bass. Come here, little boy. <laughs> it's a little bit bigger. <clears throat> 600 gram sea bass. And you're eating. <laughs> we are eating breakfast, and you cast the, the rods, and you you are alone, man. I'm not helping you. That's not. After the peak of activity from the fish, we swapped to a soft bait. Since the water color was very muddy, we used the Life Target Slow Roll Shiner, slow retrieving on the bottom, and that helped us to get the biggest fishes oh, of the day. I got a fish. Yeah. Yeah, I got a big fish. It's off. Man, the bite was huge. Fish. Mm, it's a sea bass. Yeah, it's a sea bass. Yeah, I think it's a sea bass. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's a weak fish? Oh man, it's heavier than I was like, thinking. Look at this rod bending. Yeah, it's a... Oh, that's, that's a nice one. That's a nice one. It's a weak fish. My biggest so far. He just swallow the soft lure. He's gonna break the line. That's a problem because they have really, really sharp teeth and she's just swallowed the, the lure and it might break the light because I'm fishing really light so I don't want to push it. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, it's now. You ready? It's a big one. Ah, so cool, man. <laughs> it's beautiful, man. I was thinking it was a sea bass, but no. Man, this is such a beautiful fish. Look at this. Then I was just covering water with the life target completely swallowed. Hey, stop my jacket. The slow roll shiner from life target completely swallow it. Such a beautiful fish, man. Fish, no? It's way too big for that rod. <laughs> yeah, man. Is that a surf? Oh, man, that's a big sea bass. That's a big sea bass. Man, that's a nice sea bass. On the bottom, no? Yes, on the bottom. That's a big sea bass, man. <laughs> Nice! No net, what do you think? Yeah, that's a big one. Oh my God. Yes! Yes! <laughs> man, that's a healthy big fish, man. That's a healthy big one on that rod. Look at this big. We didn't fish.
fish a lot of hours, but we did fish on the right time, man. Thank you so much for having me here, bro. The king of metal. Yeah.